What is up guys, this is AJ Barker here, welcome to episode number 14 of Mario Kart Wii. Now, I am playing as Luigi again, I upload every Monday, Wednesday, Friday, let's continue on. Now, the last video was talked about Ryan 99 huge thanks to you guys for supporting him, and also thanks to you guys for watching, huge thanks to that. Now, I'm going to talk about another character in this Mario Kart game, the Miis. You know, in Nintendo has Miis. It's like in the Mii channel, you can create your own me, and you can actually create, play your own me. Now, I really want to do that, and I want to... I think I lock it by winning this race or cup. Looking forward to that. Also, we're going to talk about this. It is Christmas season. It's a Merry Christmas. Happy Holidays for y'all. So, what are you guys going to do for Christmas? Comment down below what you're going to do for Christmas. I mean, I'm still going to have a Christmas E upload. And I will have something in mind probably after Christmas, because which I was going to do for 2022, but I might do it a little earlier than I expected. Whew. Now, yeah, da -da. who's your favorite like like uh, gift that you got? The favorite gift you got for Christmas in the past, or gift you're looking forward to for Christmas? I mean, I'm sure you guys have a lot of gifts that you want to get. I'm just very happy to be with my family too, and I get gifts too. However, one family gift I'm glad we got is this Nintendo Wii. Well, actually, no, this is not the gift. The original Wii was a white one, but it got coughed out or something, so we bought a new one a while back. It's a black one, and it's still serving its purpose. Originally, it was just the family room Nintendo Wii, but it just never got its full use, or I wanted to be playing it in private, which I'm doing it right now. And Mario Kart Wii is one of my family's favorite games, and I just got zapped again. Also, I kind of need your guys' help on this in the future because I want to play Smith. Uh, sorry about that. I want to play FNAF Security Breach, and I just I do one. Whew. So I get the win, and I am on top of the world. That's only for the first race, I know, but hey. Let a guy have fun. Now I'm going to be in Koopa Cove, just chilling out. Three, two, one. Look off. Got from like some of the old games, like Living Books games a long time ago. Anyway, what is one thing you're looking forward to for Christmas year? I already said favorite gifts. What are you looking forward to though? Let me know down in the comments below because I'm sure you guys probably have a lot of gift ideas that you guys want to either have or want to give to people as well can you remember a gift that you're giving to people i'm actually what i've been doing lately is with my father since usually sometimes fathers are very hard to buy for which is facts i get him gifts that he used to have because something happened where they stopped working or broke mainly like cds i'm old school i know and one of the things he lies i hate that First thing is that, and I'm a little teeny tiny, and Rosalina! Ugh. That is unlocked when you go from Super Mario Galaxy. Hey, Rosalina. You may be powerful, but you can't handle the red shell. Papa Wheelie going through. And some things I also learned, learn, this is something you should know, is what my family likes to do, or what they have in common. It could be as simple as just killing a page off a calendar, some like calendars. Liking cats and Japanese culture, which is my sister, by the way. Or my mom, like, she loves learning about some favorite countries, or. And even though. And even likes learning Hebrew or other holidays. So that's just some things I've known. And also, I also. Myself, I'm a priest. I try to keep it simple. Oh my word! Oh no, you don't, Rosalina. All right, she's in the lead for now. Let's see if I can, see if I can, see if I can play this to the game. Beat this. Oh! <laughs> oh, that was a nasty shot. When there are the odds of that happening? Yo! Whew. Anyway. Where, 
anyway, my advice for anyone one that wants to understand Christmas gifts for people, like, you want to know what they want, just know what they like. Like, if they like a Nintendo Switch, they go on Nintendo Switch games or merchandise. You know, or maybe some Nintendo merch. Maybe even maybe get them uh, something from Mario, like a Mario bit cap or something. Or if they like playing Xbox games, you just probably get some Xbox merch as well. If, or if they're favorite Xbox game, you have the money. And what if you're like, Aaron, read my lips, I'm dead broke. Sometimes, <coughs> Ooh, bless me. Some, sometimes the best thing they need isn't always a get something that is given to what they want. It's what they need to, to know they have for life, you, which is usually family. Anyway, with a second race. And, ooh, looks like Rosalina and Oreo are really going at it. Hmm, I don't see Bowser. Let's go to the third race. This is the feeling of autumn. As I'm recording this and being uploaded, it's the last day of fall for the United States. And let's, and let's just say just about all the leaves are gone, like, because it's been windy. But they, in Texas, for some reason, they hang on a little longer. It's like, it's like Texas is saying, hey, no, 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 we don't want you, we don't want to lose you. But it gets very, what you might call, hot and cold. But you might, some might call it bipolar weather. Because it gets hot, it gets cold, it can't make up its mind. As I always would say in real life, I don't really say it on here a lot. They should, Texas, should, my governor, Governor Abbott, should put a sign that says, Welcome to Texas, where the weather is unpredictable. But then again, a lot of other states can say it as well. Maybe your own country might have some crazy weather. You, maybe you got some crazy weather stories. Comment down, comment down below as well. At the raw. Ooh, that was close. <laughs> some Every state or country's got some crazy weather story. And... I am sure that you guys know about the huge tornadoes that hit the Midwest, United States, and that is horrible. I will say that. I hope everyone is recovering. If you guys are hit by it, please, you have my prayers. Seriously. You, no one should ever have to go through that. Now, as I am uh, going through these double boosts here. And you back from the bed to make you want to flip, flip. Toby Mac, uh, extreme days. For you guys don't know. Let's see. Mm, straight back. Flip, flip. Oh, it's like 11. I'm, and I'm way ahead of competition. Whew. And I got a crazy weather story for you. Let me listen here. On November 22nd, 2004. Still remember the date. Like it was kind of still recent-ish. I don't know why. A massive storm came into my city. And when my family got out, the neighbor's fence bent downward to one direction. And then a huge tree branch fell in front of our yard. The backyard, that is. Excuse me. It was in the backyard. Sorry. And unfortunately, as I went close to it, just by having a to call him from an earlier incident I noticed smoke coming from the tree branch that's when I realized that I was hit by lightning so that was that is my crazy weather story of the past a recent one however was in February of this year when there was that massive snow and frosty the an ice blizzard whatever you guys call it something that, that happens every 30 years in Texas we don't have a lot anyway I got another race done, and how many times I got hit by that shiny shell? Goodness. But anyway, let's get to the last race. We're in Growing Volcano. Oh my gosh. Eh, we're gonna have to really focus here, and woo! Anyway, to continue on, that day the it's actually had where the tree branch fell and made a huge mess. We were about to start our vacation driving all the way to Tennessee. I'm in live in Texas for anyone that doesn't know. 
and where I lived, driving to where we need to go took us nine hours. And it it basically took a lot long time and driving wasn't during the day, it was at night. So my dad did a lot of nighttime driving. So my advice for you guys, if you want to drive at night, make sure you have a lot of coffee or have someone that can drive well at night. Now, da, 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 da. Whew, good thing I blocked that. Unfortunately, that was the last time my family drove to Tennessee for Thanksgiving because let's just say it's very, very hard for my family just to drive in and out to another state after a great time. It was unfortunately the last year for my family just to go for Thanksgiving there, but I will also point out that when I was there I had a cracked car remote and when I was in Tennessee I accidentally hit my head like literally hit my forehead and had to go to the hospital so I will say that I have very interesting stories and here's the kicker that happened on Thanksgiving I went to the hospital on Thanksgiving probably one of the worst experiences I've had and you think that got and you think that could get any worse I ended up going to the hospital the next year on Christmas because a dog, dog got her, bit me on the leg. So as a result of that whole thing, I ended up having to get stitches on those last two injuries on my forehead and my leg. Let's just, I was holiday prone just in 2004 and 05. Thanksgiving and then Christmas in 05. Goodness, it was horrible. And I hope you guys never have to go through that. But do you have any crazy holiday stories where you have to go to the hospital? Please, comment down below. I'm interested to hear that. Seriously. Ugh. Oh, no, no. Oh, no. I didn't see that coming. Hang on. Warriors get Warriors in the lead. Oh, oh, oh. I got over. got over. Oh, woo. Yeah. Barely beat him. Woohoo. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh. Wait a minute. Guys. 38. Who gets third? It's Wario! Whew. Let's go to the award ceremony. Alright, got the gold trophy. Three stars again! Yes! Now, since I already did three races on, on races on top, because you, there's like eight races and you do four on top, you get rewards. Let's go see what rewards we get. I unlocked the large bike to shoot a star! Awesome, that's my reward. Nice. Alright guys, that is it for Mario Kart Wii. If you guys enjoyed the stories I told you, please let me know in the comments below. And again, comment down below your favorite stories that I've said. said, Or your favorite stories that you can explain for holiday, injuries, or anything like that. Anyway, don't forget to like, share, and comment. And also give a super applause. Plus support the channel. Or join my memberships if you guys want to support my channel more. Anyway, hope to see you guys in the next video. You guys know my saying, God bless, you rock, don't you ever forget it.